Um, you've met Oprah, you've spoken at Inbound, you're an author. Talk to us, Kim. Long ago, if you spoke with someone, that might be the last time you ever saw them. I, I worked in sales for well over a decade. But now, if they know your brand name, anyone can find you on social media and the internet at large. How do you fix broken sales tactics? That's, that's the question. I kind of had this realization. I'm like, oh, is this really what I want to do? Left, I sold my house. I traveled around the world for six months. I figured life is too short, so why not live the life you want? So now it's about the long game. It's about building trust, being upfront about the fact that you are trying to sell something, but then also being honest about why you believe in the product or service, not trying to play them or manipulate them. People aren't answering their phones anymore. People are not opening up their doors. Right now, the gold is in the value. The gold is in the consultation. The gold is in the education that we provide. Still to this day, there's so many you know misconceptions about what sales is. University graduates come through and they're still imagining the salesperson being the Glengarry Glen Ross. You you know, I think the solution is just, is reinvention. ABC, always be closing. We're not there anymore. You might win in the short term, but the long term you will always lose. here for the short-term gain or are you here for the longevity? And hopefully you're here for the longevity. You have to treat others the way you want to be treated. Letting go of having to close them immediately, you know, play the long game. I think that outside sales is effectively dead for the foreseeable future. Only way to break through in outside sales right now is to become an inside salesperson. Maybe that's what the problem is, is that, you know, when you're good at sales, you just assume that you'll always be good at sales. It takes a shorter period of time to go from our head to our mouths than it does to go from our heart to our mouths. But that's where all the truth and honesty needs to be. The best way to prove that you're being honest is with video because they can see your face, they can hear your voice. It's like they're in the room with you. Sell me this pen is now officially I think we're done with that. Now it's something different. Now it's only through video. Especially in the world of digital sales, now video is more important than ever to build trust. So how do you fix broken sales tactics? Every sales strategy should include video. If you're new to video, take some time to get used to it and figure out ways to integrate it into your sales process in the way that works for you. Pre-recorded videos have a tremendous power. Pre-recorded videos can be watched at scale over and over again. Now, of course, getting on a live phone call or a video chat is great, but when you wanna scale your sales operations, pre-recorded videos can be really, really valuable. You can only be in one conference call at a time, but with pre-recorded videos, you can be everywhere all the time. When you ask more questions or everything from how are you gonna measure the success of this, ultimately getting them to tell you the return on investment, how will this relationship help you to grow and evolve? So I'm helping Donnie here make an RC car. This video is brought to you by dub.com. We provide an actionable video platform that allows you to easily send videos from wherever you are. So LinkedIn, Gmail, we have a Chrome extension, so you can just click a few buttons, upload a video, or record a video right on the spot, and then send that over Gmail, LinkedIn, or anywhere else as an actionable video. So when they click on the thumbnail link, they're brought to a page where they can take action with call to action buttons, fill out a form, they can make a purchase, they can sign up to a masterclass, or they could book a time in your calendar or whatever you want. Of course, all of that is trackable so you can see who's watching your video and even how much of the video they watched. So if you wanna start integrating video into your sales process, we recommend just getting a free Dub account at dub.com. See what you think. So I'm helping Donnie here make an RC car. The reviews on this thing were absolutely terrible on Amazon. The reason why the reviews were terrible was because- The instructions it, are so hard. <laughs> it says that the instructions are extremely difficult. So they basically give you one page right here <laughs> to build the entire car. And like I grew up building RC cars and you'd have multiple pages. When I looked at this, it reminds me that this is kind of like how it is right now, figuring out how to run a business because there's no good instruction manual figuring stuff out. We have a general framework and a guide, but it's really our creativity and our, you know, ingenuity and our perseverance that I think is really helping us get through, kind of like what Donnie's doing right now. That's it for today's video. Be sure to subscribe if you're not subscribed already for more videos like this, and that's it. In the past, there were new practices, new strategies in the sales space, but I feel like in the last five years, the acceleration of change is dramatic.